had one of my weird night terrors again. I was a giant marshmallow trying to eat me and I kind of liked it. What do you think that means? Oh, did you like it? All right. Hello friends, my name is Shrink and it's time for more Blush Blush. It's been a while, I know. And we have Pose. He's available now, so let me try him out. Took a while, two weeks of clicking every day. I need you, Cole. I know, I will. The Poe. Is he a raven? Is it like Edgar Allan Poe with a raven? Is that what they're going for? I'm excited though. You're enjoying a stroll to the woods when you find a hollow stump filled with murky and leaf water. Looks a lot like free soup, actually. And you're pretty hungry. Just as you're about to take a sip, a magpie flies in the side of your head. Speaking, don't drink the haunted tree water. You're being so, so cursed. Oh, he's a magpie. All right, that's cool. How did he become cursed? Oh, did he drink it and he became cursed? Wait a minute, that's Bo. And he looks like he's speaking from experience. At least it explains why he never texts you back. Ah, all righty. <laughs> Look away. Avert your eyes, I beg of you. This is so dang embarrassing. I'm, I'm a magpie? How stupid is that? Oh, he's standing on a book. That's pretty cool. I love his design for the magpie bird. Let's see his stats real quick. He's 19. Birthday is October 7th. Hobby is reading. Blood type is B negative. Favorite job is writer. Favorite food? Ooh, mashed potatoes. Yum. Gift preference watches, occupation student, light weight observant, and height is 5'4. Oh wow. Slightly taller than me. And we're like. Alright, so I gotta take him to dinner. I will do the big ones in a bit, but for now, eat it properly. Oh, he has like an egg. Wait, why does a bird have an egg? Okay. That's cool. I like it. There's a bird skeleton inside of me. What? Sorry, I keep forgetting and then suddenly remembering. And it freaks me out every time. That would freak me out if I turned to a bird too. I got a diamond, yay. Why is a raven like a writing desk? Hmm, well, I might know the answer to that if I was a raven. I'm not a raven. Achieving a locked foul language, That's that's funny. I like that. All right, let's take him on a boat ride. Oh, okay, he's looking at his reflection mostly. Wow, an adorable pink flamingo boat. That's not at all obscenious. I wonder why nobody wants to ride around in an ostrich. Oh, right, it's because people prefer birds that are perky, glamorous, and widely celebrated in the media. Okay. Wow, that number. All right, let's uh. Oh, oh that happened already. You look concerned. It's more than you bargained for. Not really. I'm kind of used to the animal thing, so we're fine. Sure. I get it. And it's cool if you can't really help. I know how to keep my expectation low. More diamonds. Oh, he's like blushing. While strolling through the brightly lit park, Bo gives a heavy sigh. But I guess his life likely won't encounter any cursed trees in a place like this. He must be one of those good influences my mom was always on about. You should be glad we're friends. Oh, that's nice. Hello there. Kind of cool that his mom would like my character. Oh, hey. I was just lamenting over my new feet and the fact that they no longer fit into shoes. Oh, well, at least I can perch with these. Imagine being a flightless bird, like a rooster or something. That'd be so bad. Speaking of roosters... Shelby! <laughs> but yes, Shelby didn't have any trouble. Um, you want a lot of collars, so let's just grab that for you. Thanks, I'm not usually too materialistic, but uh, this actually cheered me up a tad. 6,666 collars. Yeah, I bet that would cheer you up. That's a, that's a whole lot. Why do you want collars, though? That many. Alright, let's take you on the coaster ride. I was just going to look at one and then... Oh, he's happy. He's not even in the ride. He's just flying alongside it. That's kind of cool. I wasn't screaming. I was imitating the screams of everyone else in the ride. Honestly, magpies are excellent mimics. Look it up. Well, at least one good thing to come out of this is that we got to meet in person. Wait, 
Can I still say in person if I'm a bird? Uh, who cares? Friends? Oh yeah, because we never met in person, so I always have the phone. Cool. So as a friend, would you mind helping me paint these talons? I just really miss my black nail polish. Oh yeah, I totally paint uh, your talons, Bo. Hey, what color is talons? They already oh, maybe they're just painted on here. That looks cool though. I like it. I bought this on myself. I should have known the ominous fog and creepy silence were portents of something horrible to come. Not to mention the free tree water sign. Ugh, nothing in life is free. What's with water in this game turning people into animals? Because in the main game, it's the magic water bottles from the zoo that changed everyone the animals, and now it's just water in a tree stump that was advertised somehow. <laughs> That's weird, but interesting. Yeah, I don't understand it. Ooh, 13,666 bones. Wait, why would a bird want bone? Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. And then the carnival. Is he scared? I can't tell if he's scared. I don't think he's scared. That's kind of, he's sticking his tongue out, isn't he? Ah, he's not scared at all. So it turns out carnivals are kind of great when you're a bird. There is so much free food on the ground. And did you see those people's faces when I pretended to be part of the spooky ride? <laughs> you want us to kiss now? I don't know, this feels like it has the same problem that coffee drinking thing had no lips, remember? Oh gosh, of a bird? Interesting. Okay. Alright, well, I'm trusting you. Yeah, he has no lips. He does now. A kiss, a kiss, a cure, what's amiss? You lean in and give Poe a gentle peck on the tip of the beak. Okay. A ghostly glimmer, bubbles that shimmer, and the ancient curse is almost entirely shattered. I like his picture. He still has the feathers everywhere. Looks nice though. Okay. It's Poe. Look at Poe for a moment. Oh, he still has the bird tail. Wow, it's huge. With a few feathers on his face. I like his outfit, actually. That's pretty cool. That's where all them collars went. Every day, a new collar. Behold. Versus mostly broken. Well, my mind and my soul are mostly broken, too. So that's cool, I guess. Not Poe, no. 31,313 watches. They have fun with these numbers today, don't they? Mm. What does it mean? Flushing. Okay. Dinner time. Oh yeah, let's see what his dinner looks like as a human. What are you eating? Like a potato? I can't tell. Oh, he has like feathers on his hands as well. Or his arms. That's cool. <laughs> hey, what does a vegan emo eat? Melon, cauliflower, melon... All that flower. Yeah, I told you it was a lost cause. I think that was some sort of joke. Hmm? How's that rhyme go? One for sorrow, two for joy. I mean, it checks out. It's kind of a wreck on my own, but since we've been hanging out, I guess I feel pretty joyful. That's cool. Uh -huh. Huh. Joyful. That word tastes weird in my mouth hole. My name's Mo. Oh, is me. Oh, is me. Here's line three of this crappy poem. Encyclopedias. Oh, nice. Ah, oh, I think my heart just grew three sizes. Yep. That little measuring device is officially broken. Ah, oh, see what his boat ride looks like. He is not impressed. Not one bit. That was an afternoon. Now imagine if we did the same thing, but at night, and if the cutesy boat was a creaky raft instead, and we were being fairy to mysterious cloaked figure. Now that would be something to write about. Yeah. Uh, I keep getting these weird, intense cravings for worms. I think it's worms. Yeah. You want to pick up some and share? No. What? I'm talking about gummy worms. Duh. I'm gross, but I'm not that gross. Are we gonna walk to the corner store or what? Greetings. Gummy worms are way better than real worms. I'll have to get observ observant? No. 
Misery loves company. That must be why I get a little flutter of excitement whenever I see you. Huh. Coaster time. I like his picture on there. He looks very happy and content. Um... That drop was intense. I was straight up mentally preparing for death's embrace. But the actual odds are about 1 in 750 million. So we had to go on that date like a lot more times. I think. Is that how statistics work? Yeah, I don't think you actually want to get to that part. Thank you. My professors absolutely insist on mispronouncing Bildungsroman. It used to drive me crazy, but learning to get things go has been a real theme. My own personal coming of age experience. Uh. Hey, when people are all, does a shade of black match this other shade of black? Like, black is literally the absence of light. If you're that worried about it, just close your eyes. Ta da! Nothing clashes. <sighs> That's fun. I wonder. I had one of my weird night tears again. I mean, it was a giant marshmallow trying to eat me and kind of liked it. What do you think that means? Oh, did you like it? Oh, right. Uh, right. Scariest monsters are the ones that lurk within our souls. The old pal Edgar said that, smart man. So, anyway, here's a list of stuff we need for the DIY exorcism I've been planning. I wonder. Right. Hey. That one's like tiny. I was just thinking I might have a poetry slam later. It's an underground thing, pretty low key. You can come if you want, member. If you like something, you accept it practice as a snap of your fingers. Unless you can't. In which case, just do what I do and pretend like nothing impresses you ever. Oh, he doesn't snap his fingers because he doesn't know how. Ah, uh, it's not that hard. <laughs> not so bad, you know? I mean, weird in your life seems a bit bats in the belfry, but I dig it. Like, every day is Halloween. Right. <laughs> yeah. There are a lot of weirdos around here. That's cool, though. I myself am strange and unusual. <laughs> I wonder. <laughs> that was pretty uh... cool. Hey. Uh, I think I've exhausted what he can <laughs> say so far. Uh, nope, I haven't. Want to wander around aimlessly with me? We can talk about all the bad decisions we've made. Or the terrible secrets we keep. You know, whatever gets us questioning each other's moral compasses. So how far am I from observe? Oh, I'll have one more level. A day. Oh, That's quite a bit. What was it? Observant? Oh, this one. I used coins. I think I could use the speed boost on here. Yeah, let's do it. Alright, it's down to five hours, so that's cool. Alright, I got some achievements. Misery's Company, two for joy, a gothic romance. Greetings. Nobody's ever understood me, but I'm starting to feel like you might. Yes. <sighs> Just hope the real me doesn't scare you away. How's it going? Reach the next stage of Poe. Earned a diamond. Thanks. You're a shiny beacon of love and altruism. I hate how much I don't hate it. <laughs> how many pianos? 666 pianos? Haha, uh -huh. my money. Hmm. Where is the value in a gift? Is it the essence of the object itself? Is in what it costs, there's a lot of thought that counts. If such a thing as a thought can have an inherent value at all, huh? I'll probably be up all night contemplating this. All right, a lot of carnival Howdy. time. I like his. Is he drawing? That's cool looking. I like it. I'm going to tell you this right now. I would give anything, anything to live in a haunted house. I mean, can we go back? Oh, he liked it a lot. Oh my gosh. Hmm. So much points needed for the talking. I'm craving a BB and J, but I don't have any peanut butter. This is the worst thing that's ever happened in the history of all terrible things, and I wish I'd never been born. I'll be in my room soaking for a millennium. Millennium. Soaking for a minimum of three hours. Farewell. Or just go buy some peanut butter. I mean, I maybe you can't, but I feel like you can. You're gonna be soaking. 
so I'll go and make out in a cemetery or something. No, not a uh -huh. cemetery. No. But they get a chest, like really good. So when the time comes, I plan on challenging the Grim Reaper to acclaim game of blackjack. What? That's not chess. Is that so? Okay, that one's tiny. Yeah, I know sleeping too little has a negative effect on my well-being. What, are you gonna start like, I don't know, getting to me in that calming voice of yours and offer it to keep me drift, to help me drift into a healthy REM cycle? I mean, it's not like I could stop you, even if I wanted to. I think you want me to. Uh-huh. Perhaps the, so. The moon alone in a swath of darkness. So very cold, so beautiful, and strangely sad. Does me or does it look a bit like a marshmallow puff tonight? Is that so? <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> oh, look, my favorite dream. Hmm, you're really here this time. Oh, that's so great. <sighs> Sorry if I seem a bit slow. I'm probably tip deprived from staying up all night thinking about you. Really? Oh, okay. Yes. Oh my gosh, he's a piercing. Okay. Pao gazing longly into your eyes, twinkling his fingers. Wait, twining his fingers in yours. Not kissing you is a torment, he murmurs. Lean closer. As mouth meets yours, a magical explosion occurs. The great literary tradition of true love's kiss has been upheld, and the curse is broken. I don't understand why so many poems are about love. I think every poem I write for the rest of my life might be about you. Love, Poe. Okay. Nice. My girl's nails are painted. That's cool. Yeah? Let's talk. All night long in the darkness in each other's arms and defines the social tone norms. Life begins at sundown. We can sleep when we dead. Ah, uh, what? Dead. Oh. Well, that is Poe's root. That was fun. Really fun. It took a long time to get there to get really high level for a hobby. But yeah, excited. I enjoyed it. It was fun. But thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. What did you think of Poe's root? Have an awesome day. Please like, comment, share, subscribe. I really appreciate it.